Hey YouTube, I'm going to do this video to show the uh, unusual effects in possibly large, uh, great amount of energy content in a hydroxy gas torch. So I'm going to use my uh, seven, 7 cell hydroxy generator. Um, the, this power supply will be producing about uh, 20 amps at about 15 volts. And that's uh, going to produce the gas for my hydroxy gas torch. Here's the uh, here's my hydroxy gas torch. Um, it'll be going out of the cell through a bubbler, through a little water trap dryer, and into the, the torch tip. I have these little pieces of uh, brick from uh, a brick shingle. And I'm going to uh, compare the uh, effects of the hydroxy gas torch to a uh, propane a propane torch. This is a torch from uh, Harbor Freight. And I'm going to do each test for three minutes. And we're going to compare the uh, effect on the brick uh, for propane to the torch for three minutes and the effect of the uh, hydroxy gas torch for three minutes. So here we go. Okay, now we uh, burned a hydroxy gas torch on the brick for about three minutes and we'll take a close look at the difference between the brick's burning effects on, with the hydroxy gas and the propane. And you can see that uh, the brick is melted and turned to a kind of a glassy, just glob of molten, or previously molten brick. So obviously there's a lot more uh, reaction or something going on there. Okay, propane for three minutes.
just so you see there's a flame. Uh, the video cut off part way there but I did the uh, propane for three minutes and take a look at the brick uh, there's no melting of the brick or any uh, uh, really other than a little bit of shade of black you can't really see that I even did propane on it <laughs> 